Hello, for today's How I Troll video, I am going to be showing you how I farm Shade in the Dawn. It's part of the path of training. The reason that you would want to farm this is it's one of the few places you could actually farm for Wind Vampire pieces, which is one of the better Nat 5s in the game for being able to speedrun dungeons and also get high scores on the world boss. You also would want to farm Path of Training because it gives Unknown Scrolls, which are very valuable for getting your natural 1 and 2 star books up, as well as Rainbow Mon for if you're struggling to evolve monsters in the early game, and Energy of Transcendence pieces for transcending your summoner so you could get up to level 70. Now, for the How I Troll video, I'm going to be showing you how I can do it with all ghosts, that way it's ghosts versus ghosts. See how this goes. I actually do farm Path of Training as the main path that I will farm because since I've transcended all my summoners and basically don't need runes anymore, the unknown scrolls are the main value that is added to my account whenever I farm paths because. Gaining more unknown scrolls will help you reach higher natural one and two star books, and in the long run, those take a lot longer than even three star books take to get. So, it's highly valuable to actually farm here, even though it gives less experience to your summoner. Yeah, that was uh, Shade in the Dawn with some ghosts. Let it run one more time, real quick. It's a very easy dungeon of arm, so almost any damage dealers you bring in, you'll be able to complete it. As long as your rings are like 5 star or higher. Yeah, that was Shannon and Dawn. Hopefully you like the troll team. Have a good day. You'll start